The Home of Heroes is getting some more resources to help veterans in active duty military in that community. Mount Carmel Veterans Service Center is expanding to Pueblo to let veterans know they are not alone. News 5's Ashley Portillo joins us live from St. Mary Corwin Hospital to tell us more about the expansion and how one veteran is helping others. Ashley. Yeah, so this is where Mount Carmel Veterans Service Center, they have set up their office here in Pueblo, and this office will be providing resources as well as services for the nearly 14,000 veterans who live here in Pueblo County. I never had those opportunities or the knowledge or resources when I served or when I was getting out. Don Maynard is a U.S. Army veteran. He now works for Mount Carmel Veterans Service Center in Pueblo and is giving a hand up for other heroes. Being a veteran and being able to serve other veterans and understand what it's like to be in their shoes and what they've been through means a lot. Mount Carmel expanded to Pueblo because they saw a need. We're going to see a lot of veterans locate to Pueblo County due to the high cost of living in El Paso County. Some of the resources offered, transition and employment, veterans and family resources, and behavioral health and wellness. Doug Fitzgerald is the community coordinator for the center, and he says... In Pueblo County, as compared to El Paso, there's a much older population of the veterans. So we're speaking about people who served during the Cold War and the Vietnam era. And Maynard mentioned he's spoken to many veterans who often wished there were similar resources in Pueblo. It is difficult for some of them to get to Colorado Springs just because of the distance and some of the difficulties and issues that they are facing. But now the Home of Heroes has a center of their own to let them know they are not alone. Hopefully it makes them feel like they're supported and not alone in what they're going through. And the office, they did have a soft opening back in November, so they are here and they're already serving veterans and active duty military right here in the Pueblo community. And by the way, next Monday, December 13th, they will be having a grand opening ceremony for the office. In Pueblo, Ashley Portillo, News 5. Ashley, thank you.